the apact Latin epicte, from Greek, apacti hemerai equals added days used to be described by medieval computists as the age of the moon in days on the 22nd of March in the newer Gregorian calendar however the apact is reckoned as the age of the ecclesiastical moon on the 1st of January its principal use is in determining the date of Easter by computistical methods it varies usually by 11 days from year to year because of the difference between the solar year of 365 to 366 days and the lunar year of 354 to 355 days. equals <laughs> topic <laughs> lunar calendar equals <laughs> Apacts can also be used to relate dates in the lunar calendar to dates in the common solar calendar. Equals. <laughs> Topic: <laughs> Solar and lunar years. Equals. <laughs> A solar calendar year has 365 days, 366 days in leap years. A lunar year has 12 lunar months which alternate between 30 and 29 days in leap years, one of the lunar months has a day added. If a solar and lunar year start on the same day, then after one year, the start of the solar year is 11 days after the start of the lunar year, after two years, it is 22 days after. These excess days are apacts, and are added to the day of the solar year to determine the day of the lunar year. Whenever the apact reaches or exceeds 30, an extra embolismic or intercalary month is inserted into the lunar calendar, and the apact is reduced by 30. Leap days extend both the solar and lunar year, so they do not affect apact calculations for any other dates. Topic: 19-year cycle. The tropical year is about 365 and a quarter days, while the synodic month is slightly longer than 29 and a half days. On average, both are non-integers. This gets corrected in the following way: 19 tropical years are as long as 235 synodic months, metonic cycle. A cycle can last 6,939 or 6,940 full days, depending on whether there are four or five leap days in this 19-year period. After 19 years the lunations should fall the same way in the solar years, so the apact should repeat after 19 years. However, 19 times 11. 209, and this is not an integer multiple of the full cycle of 30 apact numbers 209 modulo 30. 29, not 0. So after 19 years the apact must be corrected by plus 1 in order for the cycle to repeat over 19 years. This is the saltus lunae leap of the moon. The sequence number of the year in the 19-year cycle is called the golden number. The extra 209 days fill seven embolismic months, for a total of 19 times 12 plus 7. equals 235 lunations. <laughs> Lillian Gregorian Apacts when the Gregorian calendar reform was instituted in 1582, the lunar cycle previously used with the Julian calendar to complete the calculation of Easter dates was adjusted also, in accordance with a modification of a scheme devised by Aloysius Lilius. There were two adjustments of the old lunar cycle a solar equation decrementing the apact by 1 whenever the gregorian calendar drops a leap day 3 times in 400 calendar years and a lunar equation incrementing the apact by 1 8 times in 2500 calendar years 7 times after an interval of 300 years and the 8th time after an interval of 400 years the solar equation 
would adjust for the Gregorian change in the solar calendar, if they were applied at 1 January of the Julian calendar instead of the Gregorian calendar as the reformers implemented it. Moreover, the corrections to the solar calendar are leap days, whereas there are 30 packed values for a mean lunar month of 29.5 days and a bit, therefore, changing the packed by one does not exactly compensate for a dropped leap day. The lunar equation adjusts approximately for what had by 1582 become the experience of many centuries, that the Moon moves a little faster than the expectation of its rate embodied in the old lunar cycle. By 1582 it was noted e in the text of the bull Intergravisimus itself that the new and full moons were occurring, four days and something more, sooner than the old lunar cycle had been indicating. History The discovery of the Apact for computing the date of Easter has been attributed to Patriarch Demetrius I of Alexandria, who held office from 189 to 232. In the year 214 he used the Apact to produce an Easter calendar, which has not survived, which used an eight-year luni solar cycle. A subsequent application of the Apact to an Easter calendar, using a 16-year cycle, is found in the Paschal Table of Hippolytus, a 112-year list of Easter dates beginning in the year 222 which is inscribed on the side of a statue found in Rome. Augustalis, whose dates have been disputed from the 3rd to the 5th century, computed a Laedaculus little tablet of Easter dates. As reconstructed, it uses a pax here the age of the moon on the 1st of January and an 84-year luni solar cycle to compute the dates of Easter using a base date of AD 213. If we accept Augustulus's earlier dates, his Laedaculus extends from 213 to 312 and Augustalis originated the use of a pax to compute the date of Easter as early as the 4th century. We see Easter computers using the Apact and the 19-year metonic cycle in Alexandria, and subsequent computistical tables were influenced by the structure of the Alexandrian calendar. The Apact was taken as the age of the Moon on 26 Feymenoth the 22nd of March in the Julian calendar but that value of the Apact also corresponded to the age of the Moon on the last epigominal day of the preceding year. Thus the Apact can be seen as having been established at the beginning of the current year. Subsequent Easter tables, such as those of Bishop Theophilus or Alexandria, which covered 100 years beginning in AD 380, and of his successor Bishop Cyril, which covered 95 years beginning in AD. 437 discussed the computation of the Apact in their introductory texts. Under the influence of Dionysius Exiguus and later, Abede, the Alexandrian Easter tables were adopted throughout Europe where they established the tradition that the Apact was the age of the Moon on of March. This Dionysian Apact fell into disuse after the introduction of a perpetual calendar based on the Golden Number, which made the calculation of Apacts unnecessary for ordinary computistical calculations. Two factors led to the creation of three new forms of the Apact in the 15th and 16th centuries. The first was the increasing error of computistical techniques, which led to the introduction of a new Julian Apact around 1478, to be used for practical computations of the phase of the Moon for medical or astrological purposes. With the Gregorian reform of the calendar in 1582, two additional Apacts came into use. The first was the Lilian Apact, developed by Aloysius Lilius as an element of the ecclesiastical computations using the Gregorian calendar. The Lilian Apact included corrections for the motions of the Sun and the Moon that broke the fixed relationship between the Apact and the Golden Number. The second new Apact was a simple adjustment of the practical Julian Apact to account for the ten-day change produced by the Gregorian calendar. See also Computers Wikisource English translation of the Latin 1582 Papal Bull Intergravisimus instituting Gregorian calendar reform. <laughs>